This billowing thick dark smoke coming from the Obile Gamon police station in Lagos gives a vivid picture of an outcome of terror unleashed by hoodlums who took advantage of the NSAR's protests. In their hundreds, they attack the police station, setting it ablaze. Anyone found around this vicinity who perhaps does not buy into their vision was also visited with anger. It was a mob action and definitely not the mission of the NSAR's protesters. In Joss Plateau State, hoodlums also took over the streets, attacking innocent citizens who had left their home early, not knowing what was coming their way. They scamper for safety. Some journalists were not spared in the melee. In a dual state, a major highway was blocked. The police are on their way. The police are on their way. Shop owners and civil servants sit at home. On your state witness some tension as hoodlums also seize the opportunity to foment trouble. The NSAR's protests may have started with a lot of genuine demands which government in turn says they are looking into, but the situation in Orile, Ibutemeta, Joss and Benin City run completely different from the NSAR's mission and perhaps this may just be the time for the protesters to review tactics so that their demands are not wrongly interpreted.